Hey Sydney, I like your new nibble ring. It's cute. Listen, if you have a moment, we really need to talk. Oh, good morning Mario. The noises you probably heard last night were from me and Gino wrestling. We were stretched out on my bed watching a movie and we decided to wrestle. Yes, I heard the grunting. I think you should move your headboard a few inches from the wall to keep it from slamming against it next time you wrestle your teammates. Anyway, that's not what I wanted to talk about. Oh, then what do you want to talk about? Should I get dressed and put on some hot coffee? No, don't do that. I like to look at you. You have a nice physique, and it will give me something to think about next time I'm having sex with my wife. She's a nice lady. Yes, she is, Sydney. but the bitch has been on my ass for over two fucking years now, asking, when will Sydney move out, when will Sydney move out, when in the hell is that little big lip douchebag going to grow a pair of hairy nuts, act like a grown man, and get his own place? Well I was looking at a place last summer, but the timing didn't feel right. I like it here. I like spending time with you. Like it or lump it, you know. Sydney, we've been over this. You're a good kid, a great hockey player, and your lips make my penis feel good. But it can never be anything more than that. Do not say that. Sydney, I'll say it all day. You're just a piece of meat to me, and I can't keep using you. You're just a big slab of beef with a pair of hot dick sucking lips at one end, and a tight little butthole at the other. Jesus Christ, even as I say this, I want to bend you over this table right here and take you. Take you hard. I want to slap your naked ass, dunk your balls in my mouth, and call Uncle Gary over for a threesome. Then do it, Mario, do it. Call Uncle Gary and tell him to bring the KY jelly. If I can't have your love, I'll settle for being your plaything. Good. That's good. I'll let you stay. And I will handle my wife. Just keep this quiet. She can't find out about this. My lips are sealed.